Welcome to a video from TheDigitalLifestyle.com In this video I'm going to look at how you can use the Microsoft account page and the devices page so you can manage your devices, you can find lost Windows 10 devices even see if there's uh, issues that you need to be looking at and all done within one website so I'm going to show you some of the things it can do um, For a start you need to go to uh, account.microsoft.com and you can go to the devices page and here you'll see all the Windows 10 devices including also some other devices like Xboxes and Android devices which I've got here uh, that are assigned to your Microsoft account and then what you can use this for is to do things like lock devices if you've lost them uh, you can remotely uh, find them you can look at any outstanding issues security up issues update issues all that kind of thing uh, all from within the browser I'm really going to concentrate on the Windows 10 devices on the iOS or the Android devices you don't get a huge amount of information on there but uh, so I'm going to look at the Windows 10 devices so I've got a few devices up and running on here some are older some are newer and uh, a test machine as well and I've also changed a couple settings on the machines to show you uh, what they look like so here you, you can see as I scroll through I've got a number of devices that all set up linked with my Microsoft account and straight away you can see here that my Surface Pro 4 has the firewall turned off so I did this earlier and straight away you get notified that there's an issue with that you shouldn't be turning the firewall off these other devices haven't that one has so we can go and have a look at that so here you can see that Windows Defender as a it as an issue with the the uh, firewall and I can see that I turned private the firewall off on the private network so straight away you can see that you've got an issue on there but while I'm in this screen I'll show you some other things you can see you can see if you've got any uh, virus issues any antivirus and you can see that everything's turned on on here I can see if there's any um, app issues that I've got on here and also you can see the device is up to date and how much space I've got on there if I go to the top you can see here which version so it's running Windows version 204 which is the May 2020 update it's on the release preview ring so it's a, a preview build that's running on that if I've gone to here you can actually see I can see the, the specs and even the serial number and the build numbers and everything else now there's another one I've set up here, this is a fast ring uh, virtual machine that has got, got find my device off so I'm going to show you how we enable that so I go to the virtual machine on there and you can see you're going to settings updates and security you'll see here that I've got find my device so that's currently off and all you need to do is change that to on it is one of the um, out of box settings that comes up so you may have you probably already activated that so I'll leave that on there so that's on and I'll show you how we can find them now so I've gone to the the map and you can see here that uh, I'm up here in the northwest of England and I've got uh, six devices there and two devices at that location and uh, I don't need to do it now but you could can zoom right down into street level and see exactly where the device is so I've zoomed right down into the street level and you can see exactly where the devices are. Now once you've got your device you can actually do some things with it. You can lock it and you can locate it. So if I go here to my test machine, I'm going to do uh, find my device. So if I do find, and there you can see the um, notification you get on the device to say that an administrator is trying to find your device. So the other thing that I can do is I can remotely lock the device so I can go on here and I can click lock so let's go lock that I can put a message saying so I can say please return let's lock that and straight away you can see here that it's signing out So I have had an email saying we've locked your account or we've locked your device and here's the device. I can log back in and it'll be fine. So I am able to log back in 
and unlock the machine. So it doesn't wipe the device or anything else like that, it just logs it, locks the machine and an admin is the only person that can sign back into that machine. Um, so it's a nice way of securing the device. Maybe you've left it at a friend's house or something on their Wi-Fi and you want to remotely lock it just in case, something like that. Uh, you can do that, so I'll lock that and that's that's fine. You can obviously change the password from here as well. So that's a quick overview of the account features on uh, Microsoft's website. Useful for finding a machine, remote locking your machine, seeing what security updates you need or what issues you've got. It does uh, keep all your devices on there. You can delete them as well. I've got sort of 80 odd devices on here because of building and rebuilding machines over time. So you can clean this up if you want to. You've got some options to do that. You've got the option of getting the recovery keys, a bit locker recovery keys, or just removing it completely from there. So it's a really handy system for uh, just keeping on top of your devices. Thanks for watching this video. You can see more on our YouTube channel. I've got all sorts of tips and how-tos with Windows 10. You can get me on Twitter at ISDixon.